unstable. Castro is such a, a key figure. Protect the freedoms and liberties of British citizens. I want UKIP to be the party that represents the interests of ordinary people. Those people who work and pay taxes. Those unemployed who would very much like to have a job but don't have one. And the small and medium sized business owners. These people are the backbone of our great country. They're not represented, they're, they're not represented by big business, the big business interests of the Conservative Party, nor are they represented by the Marxist ideologues of the Labour Party backed by the trade unions. It's not fair that international corporations can avoid taxes while people are taxed up to the hilt and yet still struggle to make ends meet. That's unfair and unjust. It's not fair that people who spend years on a council housing list and can't get a home and yet foreign nationals can go straight to the top of the housing queue because there are EU citizens and have equal rights. That is unfair and unjust. The NHS is open to abuse from people around the world and that is unfair and unjust. It's not fair that people who have paid taxes all their lives cannot get the operations or treatment they need on the National Health Service because it's become an international health service. Despite the combined forces of the political establishment, the media establishment and the international establishment campaigning for a Remain vote, they lost and we won. The so-called deal Mrs May wants to achieve is one, by, one whereby we pay the EU lots of money, uh, we obey most of their laws, continue to be subject to the decisions of the Court of Justice of the European Union and have more or less open borders. That will mean leaving in name only. Mrs May and her cross-party uh, Westminster establishment have no intention of fully implementing a complete exit from the European Union if they can possibly avoid it. They'd like to reverse the, the decision of the referendum altogether, but failing that, they will settle for Brino. Brexit in name only. Mrs May and her Tory government intend to betray Brexit. I have absolutely no doubt about that. Only UKIP will continue the fight to get Britain out of the European Union completely. Britain is one of the most densely populated countries in the world. We simply do not need mass immigration. The economic arguments put up for mass immigration are of course uh, entirely spurious. We have been admitting about one million new people every four years or so. And such an increase in the population is simply unsustainable. You only have to look at our jammed roads, our packed public, public transport system, our oversubscribed schools and our overflowing hospitals to understand that. There's something more to it. It's about big business uh, wanting cheap labour that it can move anywhere in the world where it needs it. And it's also an ideological policy. It's about undermining and destroying national loyalties and national identities in order to more readily introduce rule by supranational bodies such as the European Union. Immigration policies in the Western world are the result of an unholy alliance between big business and the political left. Big business wants that endless supply of cheap labour. Left-wing politicians want to replace the traditional working class voters that they no longer represent and have abandoned. UKIP wants an independent, prosperous Britain that believes in itself. And now UKIP needs your help in the coming months of years to help us fulfil our mission. Thank you.